Let's play the outer world. All right, so I've saved it again just to make sure. Oh, look at her lounging. I assume the groundbreaker is a ship and we're docked with it, so open. Um, transi transition to groundbreaker docking bays. Yeah, we've no idea where we're going here. So we're going to go here. Where? Well, what's this? Party selection. Yeah, Vicar. Can we have all of them? Select companion. I don't know. <laughs> what's best? Let's take. Because we need. Oh, wait, that one's lit. Oh, wait, no, that one's lit. Oh, we're going to take both. Just in case. <laughs> we'll probably get killed. Never mind. <laughs> Let's go. Right, so we're here. We're all dressed for the occasion. What? Are you talking to me? Where is he then? Where's Dick Face? Are you Dicky? Don't know who you are. Let's chat. Just checking your ship's manifest. Standard are you? procedure. Welcome to Groundbreaker, by the by. Don't mind the heat. Got okay. a few days before it reaches critical. I'm sure Miss Chief Tennyson will get it sorted before then. Uh, what? I've <laughs> no idea what she's talking hey, about. Captain. What? Oh, you. Hey, Captain. What? I heard the Groundbreakers got a real good engineer. A lady named June Lay Tennyson. Well, she just mentioned something about Tennyson. Did he write poetry? She can't be that good. This place is a dump, that do. If I had to fix a station this big, I'd be spending all my time trying to figure out what needs doing now and what can wait. I was thinking that maybe I'd ought to meet her. If you got time to swing this by, I mean. I don't got much experience fixing actual spaceships. Oh I god, more bloody jobs. Beans, Introduce Pavotti to Juliet thingy job jobs. I thought you said you'd keep this boat in good repair. Okay. I absolutely surely can. I'm a passing fair mechanic. Even Mr. Thompson would have said it's my only skill. But I'm used to working on cannery lines, AG loaders and the like. There's tricks about ships I ain't learned yet. Oh, right. All I'm looking for is a few pointers. I bet a lady who runs a whole station has forgot more than I ever learned. <laughs> okay. Um, are you asking to leave my crew and join here? Gosh, no, Captain. I aim to stay so long as I'm welcome. I okay. I think Junlei and I could confabulate over wireless or by message. Okay. And maybe when we put into Groundbreaker, I could stop by to visit her sometimes. But only when you don't need me with you. Wait, we're just here. Oh, oh no, when you go. Yeah, okay, okay. Um. Thanks, Captain. I'll be sure to make it worth your time. Thank you. Did there you want go. to talk about anything else before we moved on? Uh, no, what you got? Uh, we'll talk later. We'll leave you there. No, I have no idea where I'm going now. <laughs> what? Telegraph. Holographic shroud is in. I forgot to pick up the holographic shroud. Look, it's still inside the ship. You stupid bum. Okay, I just gotta get this. Made a mistake here. Okay, so, uh, it's Warning. apparent. Intruders will be. Oh, it's you. Shut up. Why is it upstairs? Oh, okay, well, we could go upstairs. Oh, it's me. Bloody shoot the bloody computer in a minute. Is it in here? It's probably in here. There it is. What? Okay, well, we picked up the shroud. Is it time for your regular daily period of unconsciousness? No. <laughs> what are you talking about? Uh, messages for Alex Hawthorne. Um, uh, no, wait. wait. What, which one am I pressing here? Because I don't know. Return to route. Uh, logs. So, is this giving me anything to do with... with all you? Captain's note, hammer power... 
blah 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 bits bit, you know what? I can't even read this in terms of thingies logs what have we read them all and okay it doesn't matter hey what's this we got a box that's empty um what's that supposed to do I didn't know I could get in these cabins yet but this is my cabin <laughs> I like my cabin okay Let's um, just sort out my skill and points and shit at the moment. Okay, I guess... Um, uh, what's that one for? Gladys. So that's where we're supposed to be going. Um, I don't know why we're going there. <laughs> um, let's go back outside. Okay, we're going off to uh, Gladys first. I don't know. No idea why, by the way. That's not the point. He's a marauder. Yeah, with a toss ball. No, he's a mer 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 mer. There weren't any witnesses. I know we want. He's not even denied. Corporate trooper. Jackass had a coming. Felix. Hello, Felix. Not making this any better. That's Margaret. Okay, we don't want them. Well, let's have a look. What we got here, Mister? Some other bugger. Don't know. We got people everywhere. Um, no, they're probably not going to say much. We'll leave them Most to it. Right this way. Yeah. Okay. Wait. <laughs> I got a selling to do. I'm sure I got some extra crap. Yeah. Spacer's choice. Is that another one? Board approved. Buy now. But is it the same thing? I have no idea. Oh well, let's go and see what this dickhead's got to say. Hello, dickhead! <laughs> Captain Hawthorne, you said. Let me apologize in advance. I'm about to ruin your day. According to your ship's record, you've been flagged by the board. Your ship will be impounded until such a time as they see fit to lift it. <laughs> Great. We've hardly been out of Edgewater long enough to get in trouble. <laughs> now, hold on. This isn't the end of the world. Probably. Uh, how do I get it resolved? You'll want to take it up with Udom Bedford, our board representative here on Groundbreaker. No, no, I've got someone else to look at. The starboard wall of the promenade. Shines like a Byzantium commode. You can't miss it. What? What's a commode? Access to that information is above my pay grade, and I've turned down three promotions, so it stays that way. I shouldn't be right mentioning on, it, dude. but what the hell? This okay. year, impounding your ship, it doesn't happen <laughs> much. The board knows we don't take kindly to their interfering in our operations. If I have to mm -hmm. take a guess uh -huh. as to why, you must have riled up someone important. Yeah, probably, or I didn't kill him quick enough. I'll go talk to him and straighten this out. This has to be no mis- I'm not going to lie, you're in a pickle. But uh, Udom's an uh, interesting guy. Might be you all could come to accords if you play your cards right. Okay. Huh. Records show this ain't the first time your ship's been impounded. Seems to get cleared up pretty quick. You might not be in this pickle for long. Oh, and if you're headed that way, would you mind doing me a favor? Oh, another damn job. <laughs> sure. Wanda Dorset over in sick bay. Tell her the shipment's uh. not in yet. It's not coming in anytime soon, and if she'd be so obliged to get off my ass about it. Okay. Why is he on your ass? Her shipment? Let's have a look. A handful of Sam cleaning units retrofitted for surgery. I don't know much else. I stopped listening when she started yelling. <laughs> yeah, I get that with women, yeah. Don't listen. Got it. Much appreciated. Okay. Is there anything else I can help you with? Yeah, just give me all your money. Can I find a job around here? What can you tell me about Udon? No, we've done that bit. I'm looking for someone named Gladys. Uh, maybe. Most of the shipping traffic in the system passes through Groundbreaker. Every couple of months, we even get a big interstellar freighter. Oh. Two biggest operations are the board. That is, Halcyon Holdings and Sublight Salvage. But uh, there are independent operators around the promenade deck. Okay. Most of those jobs are going to take you off station, though. Okay, well, that means they can't go because of the ship. Okay. I'm looking for something a little more local. Commandant Sanita might have a couple of folks she needs killed. Okay. Bad folks, I mean. Killed. Not, uh, not regular folks. She'll be at the security desk behind me. 
Thank you. Chief Jun Lei might have an errand needs running. Not He's all tied up trying to fix our heat problem. You'll find <laughs> her in engineering. Yeah. No kidding? I'd love to get a look at this old girl's innards. I bet they're real twisty and weird. In a good way. <laughs> yes. <laughs> got it. Abigail, thanks. That's my job, after all. You've got a job? Real good attitude. Thank well, thank you, miss. It's nice Kiss to be recognized. Ass. Yep. Right. Tell us how key uh, oh. I didn't think uh, do we do that one or do we want to uh, what do you know about salvage oh, craps? Are you pulling my leg? Uh, no, I never touched it. I'm new around here. You must be one of them long haul freighters from outside the colony. Yeah, yeah. Well, I won't hold it against you. <laughs> it goes like this. Back on Earth, before the crossing. The powers that be were selling off stakes in distant star systems they thought had potential. Potential. A bunch of companies decided to throw in together and form the Halcyon Holdings Corporation, then buy up the rights to this here colony. That group's what we now call the board. Okay, so the board. <laughs> How does... Groundbreaker was one of the original colony vessels to come over on the crossing, a few years before her sister ship, the Hope. The hope. Once everybody had been dethawed and dropped dirt side, the original crew of the Groundbreaker decided they rather liked the spacefaring life. Oh, really? I guess that was the start of our independent spirit. Now, here we are. Huh. Okay. Um, so there's actually a boardroom somewhere. Sitting around, drinking whiskey and smoking cigars, yeah, probably. Can't say for sure, of course. Doubt I'll ever see the inside of it myself. Uh-huh. What, the inside of a whiskey bottle or what? The board runs... Yep. Groundbreaker's the only real independent port. Aside from us, there's just tramp freighters and wildcat miners. Tramp Seems freighters? Like every year the they port's offices get bigger tramps. and their ships take up more of the landing base. Haven't seen nearly as many tramp crews this year. All right, okay. Um, right, got it. Glad to help. Glad to help, okay. Um... Do we need, did we do one? Uh, oh, we didn't do that they one, did we? They strip the parts from derelict ships and abandoned outposts. I don't There's know. There's some that say they make the derelicts and encourage folks to abandon their steads. Uh-huh. Some light gives me the creeps. I've known folks who went to work for them and just vanished. Um, They're on the okay. promenade run by a woman named Lilia Hagen. Oh, only God, there's another so job. Avoid them. Here we go. I did there was a... Okay. Relative to the board holdings? Not really. But there's a few with the means to go where they will. There's so many things rich, I can press. But they aren't likely to look too close at your work history either. And it's, um, that's all I need for now. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, God, more or less. Oh. I'm looking for a lady named Gladys, or... What can you tell me about Udom Redford? Seems like there's some tension between the board and the groundbreaker. All right, we do you that one. Noticed, huh? Yeah, not really. I'm sharp like that. What can I say? We're passionate folks, and the board can't abide that independent spirit, especially not when it might impact their bottom line. Oh, impact their, their bottom. Just our <laughs> come through us, and we skin a few bits off the top and manifest. Uh, a good spanking to start the day. Folks around here will bluster that the board hates our freedom, but really. They know we can stop their out-system shipments any So we're going to try all the conversation here because them. more jobs we get, the better. Uh, yet your station's in a state of disrepair. You could make the board fix it. Uh, I'm glad it terrifies them. The bastards keep pushing them. It's a delicate balance, right? We could cancel their freighter's docking privileges in retaliation, but where'd that lead us? Um, they got assault know. cruisers, gunships, and a handful of mining operations at their fingertips. Right. Pushing too hard, maybe they decide we'd be better in 10 trillion little pieces. Or they cobble together a new groundbreaker and put us out of business. But right they wouldn't on. do that, would they? It's a tough line to walk, no doubt about that. I wonder if I'd have chose the other one, they've done exactly the same so far, speech. Anyway. Uh, okay. I'm, um... What can you tell me about Udon Bedford? He's friendly enough unless you speak ill of the board. Get the sense he doesn't care for Groundbreaker much. Oh, I don't mind. Not that he would, being a board man and all. He's our liaison. Liaison. Okay. Sure thing. Now then, I'm looking for... Uh, uh, am I? I'm looking for a drink. Most places <laughs> are on the promenade deck. 
Big door yonder, straight through security. There's a bar on the starboard side. Nah, there's the bar. I have a preference for the Lost Hope myself. Talk to Vera. She'll set you right. I've got to talk to Vera now. Who bloody Vera? You need anything else? You let me know. Don't want anyone saying Groundbreaker's not the most hospitable port in the colony. No. It's any port I've been to, I wouldn't know. Uh, I've done that one. I've done that one. Okay. Defense. You'll find her in the rest and go. On your left when you enter the promenade. Make What's sure the bloody you bring promenade? an empty belly. Make sure you bring an empty belly. Okay. Um, go. Be seeing you. Thanks. Can I shoot you? <laughs> How do we get in there? Wait. Where's the promenade? And what am I looking for? I have no idea to either of it. Wait, let me check my jobs. Okay, so we, uh, before we leave this piece, oh, I'm not sure whether it's back on sort of the bloody ship again. Oh, you got to be kidding me. I can't have to go back there again, I do I? Well, that's just bloody 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 dumb but oh crap oh because it's impounded okay so one of the job is on there and now we're impounded talk hey there you mind stepping back this charming little ship's been impounded and i'm afraid i can't let you near it till it's not okay can i just shoot your happy little face <laughs> don't you touch my ship does it seem hot in here to you I ain't felt so much as a tepid breeze in weeks. I hope Miss Chief Tennyson gets that fix soon. Well, it doesn't smell as bad here as Edgewater's graveyard in high summer, so I guess I can't complain. Oh, I'm starting to feel like a sisty roast in all this armor. A sisty roast. Um, okay. Uh, I don't know. I'd surely love to. But that's just not my bailiwick. You'll bailiwick? Have with what the hell's a bailiwick? Board, Mr. Udom Bedford. His oh. office is on the promenade. Yeah, I know, but I don't know where the bloody hell is. I'm off. Have yourself a pleasant day. Yeah, sod off and die. Right. Now, that means I've got to change the job because... Oh, wait, no, wait, what's that one? Is that the one I'm supposed to be going to? Glad oh, this bloody Gladys. Let's get Gladys done with. It seems to want to keep popping up. She's in the bar, apparently. <laughs> Good place to start, uh, probably. I don't know. Let's go see. Is you here? Oh, wait, what are you doing? Hello? What are you do doing? Unless you're here to file an incident report or to inquire about the bounty posting, oh, wait, I must the kindly ask you to clear out. The Mardet's offices aren't for leisure time nor loitering. Okay. I couldn't have noticed the bounty boat. Yeah, oh no. Do I look like your gossipy best friend? While yes. I'm on post, I take my duties real serious. I would have no qualms whatsoever escorting you to a cell. Understand? I've been there. I didn't like it. Fine, fine. Then get to business or get moving. Business. Um... The outlaw scientist fella, right. The board's had it out for him for ages. If you have an inkling of the where's or what for's of his location, Udon Bedford would surely like to hear it. Well, no, he's not after him as well. Um... He'll be in the board offices on the promenade. No doubt dreaming up new ways to be a pain in my ass. Yeah... Um, oh, and... Oh, got it. Glad to hear it. Anything else? No, thank you. Goodbye. What's the matter? We're the security force here on Groundbreaker. Started back before the crossing, you know. What crossing? I didn't see one. <laughs> the original force was made up of a marine detachment from the 77th Marine Expeditionary Unit, Trailward Fleet. Folks started calling us Mardettes because it was easier to say. Guess it's stuck. Guess it's stuck. <laughs> okay. What about... Oh, wait, wait. Got a hot one for you. Captain Gunner McRed. Just 26 hours old. Uh, the posting, that is. Not the criminal. 
<laughs> okay. Uh, allegations include several counts of flying under the influence, carrying open alcoholic containers, failure to pay docking fees, resisting arrest, and assaulting not one, but two officers. Okay. Swerving in the air was more like it. Then he crashed hard into the dock and tumbled out of his ship and fled on foot. <laughs> Spilled Rizzo's Violet Spectrum vodka all over Officer Hartley. An affront of its own, considering none of us are approved for anything higher than Green Spectrum. Um, I don't know what the bloody hell you're on about. Um, any leads on where I find them? Last tip we got pointed toward the back bays. You want the reward? Do the legwork. You're so friendly. You and about six other enterprising mavericks. It's only a matter of time before someone brings me McRed's head. So or we got lucky lion, kill him. As proof right. Kill. I do hope you're the lucky hunter, though. Good luck and skip speed to you. Skip speed, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be on my way, thanks. Uh, you gonna say anything? Hi there. Haven't seen you around before. Oh, you. What can Groundbreaker Security do for you today? Um. Uh, can I borrow your lipstick? Chief Tennyson don't generally hire outsiders for station jobs, but you could try asking Who? a sublight salvage. They got an office on the far end of the promenade deck. Okay. On the Anything far else end. I can help you with, mister? Uh, no. No, oh, I don't know. Probably. Chief Junlei Tennyson. She runs the ship. Does a real great job of it, too. Yeah, looks it. Her family's worked on it for, gosh, since it was built, I think. Oh, why? Back right. before the crossing. What's she like? Is she a good boss? Good as she can be, I guess. What with all the troubles Groundbreaker's facing. <laughs> she could stand to lighten up, I suppose. But she tries her best to do right by folks, and that's what matters. Okay, well, there you go. Um, the uh, ship the size of Groundbreaker must be a challenge. Why do you want to know that, Pavo? Oh, no, no, no. Sure is. But she makes it look easy. She's real competent, our chief. Even if she ain't real friendly. Real friendly, like the rest of you bastards, that's for sure. This is the security desk, sir. Okay. Is if it you're secure? If you report a crime, you'll want to talk to Commandant Sunita. Huh? I'm not authorized to take incident reports anymore. <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> I'm not so good at filing. Mix up first name and surname one, two, seven times. Well, folks are liable to start taking your filing privileges away. Okay. I, uh, I bet you got seized, sure. contraband. And so from outside the system, too, off okay. the uh, interstellar freighters. That's why we also have so many armed Mardettes on duty here. So many. Okay. Do you do. We can't just let anyone walk in here. I wouldn't be, uh, well, that's not, uh, we just don't. Okay. <laughs> Maybe if you clear an open bounty and get in good with Commandant Sunita, or help Chief Tennyson fix this heat, that might warrant a thank you tour or something. Okay, uh, that's how we gotta do that. I told you, I'm not allowed to file stuff anymore. I'm trying to pay you a bribe, Lee. Oh, right. Uh, okay. Uh, mind you don't touch nothing. Fees or no, the other Mardettes won't take it kindly. <laughs> I don't know why I did, but anyway, it's okay. So I far... I heard a signal the other day. It was coming from Monarch. Here we go again. Here we go the again. There's a Mardet. We don't know any of the Mardettes. What's in here? Okay. <laughs> Departures. Uh, arrivals. Okay. Well, you know. Messages. Lots of messages. Um, what good are they? Exit. Can I just hit him on the head and run? Yep, right, leave the door open. Um, let's open this door. What's in here? It's a lift. 
Restricted access. Oh, we're not allowed in there. Okay, not allowed in there. There's Mardet. Um, we're still heading off towards Dudut. Hello, hello, how are you? How are you? How are you? Is that steel? Um, oh crap, maybe we. Um, hello. You ever hard up for work? Try some like salvage. Good pay and morally flexible. Okay. That maniac on Monarch still screaming into the comms board. Getting real sick of it. Okay. <laughs> no, no idea what I'm about. Is this a door? Oh crap! It is a door. Is this the promenade? Or berry crunch, triple gel flakes, and purple berry flavored power nuggets. Now with twelve percent more crunch. Oh, you, yeah. Rizzo's mock apple cider, a hard cider for a hard life. Oh, I didn't know there's stairs there. Wait, how am I supposed to find this bitch? No, that's not what we want. This is the one we want. Gladys. Now, how are we going to get to that? Is there, I mean, you know. Let's have a look. What's through here? Okay, so where's Gladys? We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following story. The board would like to remind spacers and other travelers that There's lots of beds. Mechanicals all over, but they still got us wet in the boxes. Here's the news anchor. Okay. Plenty of beds. But there's no... What's her face? She's kind of down in that way. No, so it's not that one. Is there anything this way? There's another door. Barred. Um, okay, well, we'll take that instead then. So, how are we supposed to go that way? We're not. Get that way, bloody woman. Um, we've been in there, and it ain't that way. Right. So, that leaves us back through here. Um, Rizzo's purple berry fudge, a soft flower candy shop. Sit behind the wall. Purple berry Wish we had bigger weapons. But no. Yeah. Be careful about blowing holes in the hall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I'd be careful as well. You know, there's like space outside. Carry on. Carry on. Rizzo's lemon. Right, so where are we going to get to this woman? God only knows. Hello. You must be getting close. Um, who are you? Move up. Huh? Got my sights on you. Okay, not a lot. Is this the bitch? Ooh. <laughs> Pick. Um, Don't make any smart moves. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm. Bless my heart. A stranger come knocking on a poor old woman's door. A poor old woman's door? You here door. for a particular reason? Or did the neighbors tell you how good my sugar cookies are? Made without a single natural ingredient or an oven. <laughs> Just like store bought. Um, Those have been the height of illegality since Stellar Bay turned their noses up at the board. You and I could be thrown to the void just for discussing such a transaction. Okay then. Lucky for us, Groundbreaker's a free port. We're outside of the board's control. For the time being, at least. All right. Now, I only have the one nav key. And they're hard to come by these days. It won't be cheap. If you find yourself lacking in the bits, I might have an opportunity you'd be interested in. Well, I might have an opportunity, yes. 
Tell me about the opportunity. Phineas, that old kook. He was quite the dancer back in his prime. Did he tell you? Real <laughs> light in his speech. No. <laughs> Real light in the wallet, too. He still owes me a small fortune. Laws. Maybe I should charge you double. No. No, no. No, no. Well, I find I'm in need of a ship captain with a little moral flexibility. Might be this could help out the groundbreaker, as well as earn some bits. But if you've got qualms... No. They come in packets or what? Do you know Edna over in engineering? No, not really. Sweet as a pea, that one. Sweet as a On pea. occasion, she'll pass along transmissions I might find interesting. Uh -huh. She sent me a recording of a distress signal she'd scraped from the Groundbreaker's comm array. Oh, right. Curious thing is, it came from an outpost called Roseway. And Auntie Cleo abandoned that place years ago. Who's Auntie Cleo? Oh, for God's sakes. Why was... Can't say I know for sure. Maybe it um, never really was. Never really was, right. Comm centers don't operate themselves, Captain. Someone had to have sent that distress call manually. Okay. Those corps are cleverer than all get out. What? Might have been a ruse to keep the rest of the board from sniffing around. Sniffing. Um, maybe it's some sort of automated message. Edna didn't seem to think so, and I trust the dear girl's judgment. Well, maybe not in men, but she knows her comms. So, like as not, someone's been down there recently. Uh, down where? And if someone set up shop in Roseway, I'd wager they got something to hide. Well, that'd probably be good then. Maybe whatever they're hiding went to heck, and now they need a few spare hands to clean up the mess. Right on. If you should find a secret worth selling, might be I could find a buyer. Corporate bigwigs will pay top bit for inside information on their competitors. Um, well, the more we got the corpse fighting each other, the less time they got to meddle in our affairs. Yeah, all right. Um, so you need someone to snoop around for you. My goodness, aren't you quick on the uptake? I like that. <laughs> quick take. Should you find yourself responding to a certain distress call, and in so doing find yourself in possession of certain valuable corporate secrets, well, then we ought to have a chat over a pot of tea and my famous cookies. Okie dokie. Um, I'll stop by if I find anything. Or... Law bless your atoms. Here's a copy of the SOS recording complete with the coordinates. Thanks. Don't forget to come find old Gladys when you're done. Okay. Will it be worth my while? I've got a lovely little throw pillow. Just something I toss together. Like to keep my hands busy. <laughs> no, thank you. We're in the shop mode, so we can do this. Okay, I've done some uh, selling and stuff, and I've no idea what I've been selling and buying. But, however, um, oh God, why do I want that one to go? Here we are, back in a bloody bog as you, what was that, a rat? Did you see a rat? Oh, hello. Oh, nothing in that one. Okay. Um, no rat. I've seen a rat, I'm sure I've seen one. What? Oh, the news. We don't care about the news. What's upstairs? Where are we supposed to be going? We're just having a... Oh, oh bloody, I missed it. <laughs> yeah, climb. What's in here? Hello. I get strange comms chatter every time I fly by Monarch. Well, don't do it then. Is this stuff? I mean, do I need to be here because use terminal? Apparently not. Pay, pay to view is restricted. Diamond level. <laughs> pay to view. 
Okay. Oh, that one. Is that it? Pay to view. That one. That one. Okay, um, right, exit. Well, I would still, but I'm still trying to find my way around this place. So let's um, have a little bit further around. Let's just check this last door here. I don't know where he's going. Oh, well, in that case. Let's uh, open it. Come in here, duty. Thank you. Let's shut this damn door. Right, you stay there while I search the place. Nothing, just a bed. Great. We we'll take the bottle. What's he got in the fridge? <laughs> all right. So we are going to have to uh, leave it there. I'm going to steal all this stuff. Now the door's stuck shut. Um, then um, we'll have to continue on afterwards. I'm not sure where I'm going with this yet. I've got to check all the jobs. But that's about it. So let's open the door again. We'll see you later.